the Emmerdale was seen gazing into the eyes of a man, believed to be Simon, who played farm estate client Hugh Bryant on the ITV show last year, according to The Sun. Fiona was captured holding on to her rumored bow's head as the pair held hands for the cute offering. Many of her 48,000 Instagram followers took to her page to comment on the picture. One user penned, A -W 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 I love you too so much. Big hug and kiss. A second added, what a gorgeous couple and a beautiful picture. So happy for you babe. A third commented, one lucky guy. Another picture obtained by the publication showed Fiona leaning on her rumored boyfriend's shoulder as he beamed for the camera. Uck has contacted a representative for Fiona Wade and Simon Cotton for Comment Co Express. An ITV spokesperson said, we don't comment on our actors' personal lives. Back in March. The actress seemingly wanted to keep her love life under wraps, telling the publication she was dating an actor and writer but did not disclose his name. She reportedly said, I'm with someone right now he's an actor and writer based in London. She added, it's fairly new, we've been together since last year and he's a very wonderful guy, but I've kept it quiet. I just wanted time to get to know him, he's very special. Simon's on-screen roles have included his portrayal of Ronnie Cray in films The Rise of the Craze and The Fall of the Craze. He also appeared in Rise of the Foot Soul 3 in 2017. It appears the rumored romance isn't Fiona's first with a colleague with the star previously confessing to dating colleagues in the past. She told The Sun, I have dated co-stars, because you do, that's how you meet people. You work with them 24-7. I went out with a guy I worked with in the theater for a while. Then I dated an actor in the Emmerdale cast after I joined the show. We were both single at the time and got on really well, but it didn't work out. Everything is fine now though. We are still friends. Fiona also revealed she is open to the idea of having children. She added, I would definitely like a family of my own one day. It's something I haven't thought about massively. I've been very career-orientated so far, but maybe I should.